Hey everyone, welcome back to Life Talk. Rimi, how you doing? I'm doing great. I'm still in my lovely library. I hope you're doing Fabulous. <laughs> Man, you are just, you're just a, a bookworm, right? Like just <laughs> exactly. Keep on reading. Keep on reading. Yes. I like to well, be surrounded by books. <laughs> that's right. From, uh, surrounded by wisdom. Uh, <laughs> second page. Um, now, welcome back and welcome to all of you, all of our viewers, wherever you are in Latin America, in uh, Asia, and uh, dreaming, we have followers everywhere. I mean, in Asia, I love it. In, in Africa, in Latin America. So, hey, uh, welcome all of you. Uh, I, I'm excited to be back again with Dreamy. We, uh, last you. week, last week we had a, a wonderful introduction. Uh, 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 she is going to be a regular collaborator, and I'm just so happy that you that that, that she is here with us again. Me too. <laughs> People, uh, Dreamy's contact information in the description box. Get get in touch with her. Watch her tutorials. Go to her YouTube channel. Subscribe, and uh, ask her questions because she ask me questions for yeah, sure. Yes, yeah, I will. When I see those questions, I always try to respond. So yeah. yes, there you go. You cannot refuse that offer, right? Um, you had a, a great, uh, a good week behind you. A, yes, a good, of course. A, a great Thanksgiving. <laughs> yes, wait. I did all my work beforehand so that I could actually enjoy Thanksgiving when it comes. So it's a it, restful, restful. That's how we, we're all about the rest. All right. I remember my Thanksgiving days in, in the states. Oh, that was, that was, you know, it was, it was good. Was, you should you know, do it again. You don't have oh, to be in the states to enjoy it. I know, I know, but it, it, somehow I need that flair. You know, you, you just you used to be the you know the, the family yeah. And, yeah. and and the preparations. Yeah, and, and then sitting at the table. Well, that's your challenge. You have to do now for next year. I'm challenging you to do a Thanksgiving in <laughs> Germany and invite people. <laughs> oh yes, that would be a nice thing to do. Ah, yeah. Hey, that would that's an idea. Hmm. There we Why go. Not? There you go. Well. Uh, well, uh, who knows? Maybe, maybe uh, Christmas is, Christmas is around the corner. Yeah, it will be also an opportunity to invite people. You know, this uh, what what was that way in the states? I mean, I know in the states it was different during the pandemic. I mean, it depending right. depending on what uh, state you went in, right? But for right. example, here here in in Germany, uh, the first two Christmas of the pandemic. We were yeah. not allowed to, to celebrate it. Right. In, in, in the whole country. You yeah. know, like uh so just be home, be at home uh, and don't get, don't talk to anyone. Type of yeah. Thing. It was crazy. Yeah, and, really and, crazy. And then this last year, uh we were uh, it's it feels so weird to say that we were allowed, but yeah, it, but yeah, they told us that we could celebrate with, with few people not too many people so right. uh, it, it was like that also in the states or it, or it, it was different in, in, in it depended on where you were from there were some places that were extremely like regulatory and then there were some places that were less so i mean there was restrictions everywhere right um we actually live in um i, I think you know i think i showed it to you we live in a camp a christian mm -hmm. camp and so our community is kind of a closed community. So even though, so our, our circle was actually yeah. a bigger circle. Right. Um, and because they still worked, then we were always exposed to the same people. We work and we live and we, you know, so our bubble was a bigger bubble. Uh, it's beautiful. Um, yeah, it was really nice. And not only that, but we also live in central California. And mm -hmm. so Northern California was really, really strict, but where we are at, there's a lot of like salt of the earth farmers for generations. And they were like, we're fine. We're good. You know? Um, and so we've seen we worse. <laughs> yes. Yes. And they, they just, it didn't seem to affect us in the same way as it did other parts of the world. Mm. Um, and I was so thankful for that because for me, um, when I start to feel really oppressed and, mm. you know, controlled, I, I, I just, I don't like that feeling. No. Um, and, you know, I still, I wore the mask and all that stuff. I didn't, you know, I wasn't one of those people that are like out on the streets protesting because I just feel like peace, peace mm -hmm. goes 
a long, in a long way. Um, and I do believe that there are times where you do need to resist, mm -hmm. but in, in this situation, we were, we were kind of in the middle and okay. um, I was, our, our area was experiencing such a calmer pace of what was happening that I just felt like I'm thankful and mm. let's just not rock the boat. Let's just keep <laughs> let's what we enjoy had, you know? it, right? Exactly. Well, I, so. well, I'm glad. I'm glad you didn't experience what we experienced here in yeah. Europe. It was yeah. Crazy. Europe really had it hard. Yeah. It was. It was. It was crazy. I'm telling you. It was. It, yeah. But that's another topic. But okay. Uh, but 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 <laughs> we're free. Was, we're free. <laughs> well, yeah. Well, that's another topic. <laughs> okay. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I mean we're free. Yes, that's that's true. We are free, and uh, and uh, and we know where our lives is rest from, right? That that yes. that's 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 one thing, you know. So uh, our faith goes a long way, right? It, 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 yes, you know. But uh, in the green, it, it, is that is that a right phrase? Grain that, scheme. Grain scheme. Yeah, grain scheme of of things. You know, um, things are. Uh, weird let's let us put it yeah. that way it's a little weird yes a little but weird. um yeah. but uh anyways uh, let, let us um uh enjoy thanksgiving well you already did <laughs> yeah <laughs> and, and, and soon christmas that's what we want to do and uh it seems right. that it, it seems that it's going to be a, a regular christmas uh, as yeah well. i think so other other than you know don't use too much electricity there uh that, that's the next thing right now. Here. So, are you guys under a lot of like restrictions with electricity? Oh, you don't have ideas. It's, it's it's not. I'm telling you, it's really, 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 really bad. I mean, this uh, uh, in, in you know, independently of what people think of the war and this and that, right? One thing is for sure, we you know the the sanctions we are feeling. Yeah. Bad. In, right. You know, the sanctions are not in Russia. I mean, they are warm and they have electricity and, and business as usual. It's like, right. why, why, are, why are we suffering? You know, that's, yeah. that's a weird thing. That's a very weird thing. So they are, well, telling, I, us, yeah. they are telling us a lot of things, you know, like like just heat one room and and, uh, and it's wow. not that cold. It's not that cold. I mean, uh, right now we have about four, but uh, uh, in, in January we're gonna be below zero, so they are thinking about like, well, you know, only so many degrees, and or maybe like only one or two rooms, and wow. things like that. Uh, so it's going bananas. I'm telling you, it's it's yeah, it's, it's really weird. Uh, well, so you know, Penderis, he lives in South Africa, and they um, and also it's a stylish, you know. So there's a lot of people there that are experiencing the um, yaku. Um, the they're experiencing the um, what are they called load shedding load shedding where they have a specific amount of time throughout each day where the power yes. goes out yeah and each you know um, region has different settings so but it goes up to about 16 hours a day without power mm -hmm. and I'm like you know, Penn, he, he's our dev and he, he works eight hours a day. He comes home and then he has that, you know, stretch of time where he can work on Dreamport, but not if there's Amazing. no power, you know, it's just, it's so, and when he tells me, the thing is in this world, we are so isolated, you know, right. and we don't know about those things. If you follow the news, if you're reading, you know, you're not going to know those things unless you know somebody in that country. Right. And I would never know what they were dealing with unless Penn came home and he's like, okay, my power is going to be out from this time till that time, you know? And I'm like, what? It's crazy. Hours? That's it's crazy. insane. Yeah. You know, in, my, in my childhood, I experienced something like that. I mean, with, with water. So I, I kind of know, but, okay. but but I grew as poor because I went to the states and and, and now yes. I've been here for so many years. Right. We don't we don't experience that. We just no. We no. take and I think it has given me such a different appreciation. Um, the more that I see of the world. Um, let's see. In two thousand maybe six five, somewhere around there, seven, I had gone to um, El Salvador mm -hmm. and my best friend um, was living there for a time. And so I went down there and visited her. My mother was beside herself because it's like the murder capital of the world, you know, and I went down by myself. <laughs> and, um, but I tell you, I came home so changed. Change, no? There are things that you 
cannot learn from books, from the news, from the movies. You cannot learn it unless you go there and you experience it. And it, you know, and the thing is, it doesn't last. You come home and you, like you said, you know, you start to get a little softer, you start to forget. But I try to put myself in those places. And now I get to do that kind of through Hive because, you know, okay, I've never been to Nigeria, but I know enough of the people that I love that tell me of their daily experiences, you know, and now Germany and South Africa and, uh, you know, all around the world that it, 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 it awakens me in a way that nothing else can, you yeah. know, it's, it's incredible. I mean, it's, it's a huge world. And, and as you said, you know, sometimes we, because it's, it's just normal, I guess, you know, it's just natural, you know, you go about your day and, yeah. and, and you kind of like lose track of things and, and there is not enough time, really, to, right. to, 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 to suck in all the information. Even, even though you live in a library, <laughs> <laughs> there is no time, right, <laughs> to, 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 like, to get informed. And, you know, we have an overload anyways. Yeah. Information. Like, oh. That's right. That's right. But that only through, through relationships and through people, you know. It, exactly. It's, it's, it's like really firsthand. Exactly. Type of information. And, and so true. I'll touch on this, but I won't go deep because I really don't like politics. But <laughs> I'll just say I have a friend that's in Russia and I have a friend that's in Ukraine. And what I would hear from them was so different from what I was fed by the media, you know, exactly. and it's so it's heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking to know that the message that gets pushed out is so different than what exactly. is actually experienced, you know, and yeah, uh, the only thing it, it is heartbreaking because the, the only thing that I would say is people, if you really want to know, go meet somebody from that, you know, then you will then you will know what it is for know. them yeah so my, my my tendency with everything in life and i guess that has to do with uh, with uh, me growing up in mexico and the type of uh, government that we had for for many years and and the culture i guess but 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 my i grew up with and i think that i think that's healthy if i may say so you know i i think it's really healthy you know, i i you know we have the tendency we should i mean our starting point with when we meet people is like you you trust mm-hmm. them, right and right. we need and we need that to function right, right? i mean I, we need a, a certain amount of trust uh, yes. to do business to 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 talk to each other you know what, yeah. whether there is a, a you know a neighbors uh, colleagues whatever right uh, but i believe that 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 a certain amount of un, that untrust is necessary so yeah. my, I grew up not trusting or maybe like I was doubting mm-hmm. that was what, what, what is what being said to me, whether mm. that is in media or, polit- or politicians or whatever. I said mm-hmm. like, no, I don't believe it. And not in that's because I have anything personal against that person or whatever. Right. But because right. like I know there is something, I, 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 another version of that. Right. Know? I, I right. know for sure, and that is right, life. Right. Yeah. So, so that's that's my motto. You know, some when whenever I hear the official version of something, right. I feel like like right. no, I, exactly. I will do my research because exactly. that's just the way it is. Uh, and knowing people is 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 a good way, like you just yeah. just said. Yeah. You know, the example you gave us. Yeah. So yeah. powerful. Yeah. Well, dreamy. Well, we got that the half an hour <laughs> almost almost gone. But but before before we leave, we have a, a ten minutes still, and and this is good. Uh, hopefully, the people are enjoying that as much as we. They're like, what in the world? <laughs> I know. What are you talking about? Well, this is life, you know, and uh, and, and hopefully uh, you receive a little encouragement and uh, entertainment at the same time, you know. But um. I want to uh, uh, I want to talk about uh, Dreamport and oh, that's and, uh, oh yes Dreamport <laughs> Dreamport yeah <laughs> because uh, a lot of our viewers saw your interview last week and and uh, hopefully uh, uh, they will get in touch with you yeah um so um but just like really quick in the time that uh, that that we have you know right. I came to Dreamport through a an interview really yes I, I mentioned that last time uh-huh. what can you tell you know, it's somebody is 
right now watching us and say like, well, you know what? I, I, I like to write, you know, I like to blog. I, I have my yes. journal, but hey, I heard I can m- make money online with my talent. What would be the first step? In, 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 you know, if I don't know if that's a fair question in such a, a short amount of time, but what can yeah. this person do uh, to get on the blockchain, on the Hive blockchain? Right. What advice can so, you give us? Getting on Hive, I will tell you, it is a little bit intimidating. No, it is a lot intimidating. <laughs> yeah, I know. However, you don't need to know the whole, you know, kit and caboodle in order to start. In order to start, you only have to open an account, secure your keys, do not ever lose those keys, um, and then log on and start writing. That's just the simplest thing. The next thing I would say is find yourself a community. We offer to be that community. Um, We can also, we don't try to do everything ourselves. We will often say, hey, this community, we can point you to the place to go, okay? So come to us and we can direct you where you need to go, but you will have questions. Don't, Don't hesitate with the questions, but also realize that Mm -hmm. there will be a never ending supply of questions. You don't have to have all the answers before you start to enjoy the benefit. So Mm -hmm. the big thing is just start, just start. (laughs) Well, the the first step is is, is getting it started. But um, for example, when I, when I, I didn't have dream for it, you know, I went to I went the hard way around, you know, like, oh, God, so hard, get in. You know? So hard, yeah. It, it, now I know it's easier now right. that I know. Um, right. And I believe people can open an account in easy, right? I mean, because they, you have to. So, you have yes. To I don't. Yes, there's several ways that you can. Mm-hmm. Um, and I know that there's the big accounts like easy like leofinance.io, all of these little like sub hive platforms um, that basically just so that everybody knows you get one key when you sign up for hive, but you can access that key in several different sites. So when you log on with your, it's kind of like if you have a Microsoft log on and then you go to another site that's Microsoft owned, you log in with your Microsoft key or Google, you would access, you know, same thing with hive. Um, But in order to open an account, you can pay for it, which I think is $3, but that takes a little time for you to get, you know, um, approved. But ECNC, Leo Finance and other places, they used to, I don't know if they still do it, because there was a shortage of accounts for a while when you tried to log on, they just didn't have the accounts anymore. Um, I will tell you a little secret and I'm, I'm telling it to you here. All right, all right. <laughs> um, when you have an account that's a big enough account, you can start accruing tokens that you can give to people. I am probably, I ha- I'm not gonna say how many I have, but I have quite a few. And I'm probably going to, in the year of 2023, offer ways that people can, if they want to come in through Dreamport, I will give them free accounts. Not not ready to launch it yet, but you are the first one to know. <laughs> hey, an exclusive. What do you know? Exclusive. It's exclusive. Um, awesome. But yes, there there are ways that people can, you know, get their accounts through. So you Decency have... is huge. Yeah, I I just checked the web page, and I, when 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 I click on oh yeah sign up. Uh-huh. Um, yeah, I mean, pe- people can pick their na- username. Perfect. And, uh, uh, but then, I mean, I guess uh, maybe that, that would be a, a good topic, you know, maybe like do a tutorial on, on, on how to open an account. Or, or do yeah. you have something like that in your, your tutorial? I do not. That is where I would send it to other people. I know Shadows. Um, I can also link, I'll give you that information Please. to link in the bottom. She has yeah. a whole tutorial on like a step by step guide on how to use Hive. But then also the terminal, huge. The terminal is huge for that handholding that you want right. um, that breaks down all of the steps and all of the questions. And Kitty Girl is, we call her Kittypedia because she's like an encyclopedia. I know. Um, and she's there all the time. So she's, right. there's so much help that we can point people to. Yeah. Okay. Well, um, hopefully people, uh, you know, are, they are getting uh, interested in their, their uh, antennas are going up. If if <laughs> yeah. they're if whether you're a blogger 
whether you know uh, you mentioned last time you know a, a musician an artist uh, yeah. or, photographer you know, yeah photographer Singer. Yes. Right. I mean, there is a place, there is a niche on the high there is a place. Blockchain, right? Yes. And yes. Uh, so, uh, as I said before, uh, if you have, if you want to watch uh, Dreamy's uh, tutorials and, and videos, uh, go to the channel, uh, the description. Uh, the, the channel is in that description box. Uh, yeah. And hopefully, hopefully, uh, if, if, well, if you have questions, write us a note. I mean, Dreamy's yes. here. She knows. Yeah. I mean, I'm a newbie, but Dreamy, she is also <laughs> an Prospect. And if I don't know, I know where to go to get the answer and there I will go. connect you to that too. Yeah. That's the key, right? To know yes. where to go. Right? Having somebody's hand to hold is key. It's key. <laughs> Amazing. Well, Dreamy, thank you very much. Uh, it has been a pleasure as always uh, yes. uh, having you here uh, in the live talk. Uh, any thank last uh, encouraging words before we leave? We have about two minutes. Mm, encouraging words. No, you give the encouraging word today. <laughs> Well, my encouraging words will be to uh, just to, uh, to to do your research uh, if you are interested. Yeah. I mean, those, these are hard times, and and there is there are opportunities for you to to make money online with your talents and to bless others through your yes. talents. So yeah. I I would say uh, be encouraged, research, uh, do your research, ask questions, and research. Uh, and yeah, it, that's very very important. And uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully, one of these days uh, we'll be talking. Meeting them, we'll be meeting, meeting them, them, and they'll be and, they'll be yeah. part of our tribe. <laughs> that would be awesome. Oh, that would be yeah. awesome, and that that would be cool to hear those stories, right? <laughs> yes, it would. It would. Awesome. Well, Dreamy, thank you very much, uh, and uh, uh, to our audience, until our next episode, we wish you a successful and blessed day. Have a good one. Okay.